Welcome back everyone, this is J7J bringing you another Final Fantasy Tactics Advance 2 build video, this time on Adele. Now she's a great character because she has access to the unique character class, and she's one of two female Humes that can equip ribbons along with Fremelda. For leveling up, I do recommend Paravir as they have amazing strength, ninja up for some speed, and trying to level up as a character as it has some of the most well-rounded stats for growth in the entire game. It also has a base move set of 5, and she can equip nearly everything. Sadly, it takes forever to get, and it isn't quite Orlando OP in Final Fantasy Tactics, but still an overall solid job class. Now, for her abilities, it's a well-known overpowered one. Kerator base job with high magic and dual wield. Veterans will know where this is going. I'm using counter as her reaction ability since she can attack back with two weapons from dual wield. Now, the second turn in battle is where the shenanigans start. Magic frenzy with either Thundara or Fyra, then watch the damage. In addition to the magic attack, you will also attack twice with your weapons. The fact that this does so much damage and AoE still doesn't match FFT sword skills though. Now, for her equipment, equip the strongest weapons if possible. I'm using Hyakushiki Masamune along with the Fallen Angel. Ribbon is great to protect us from negative status ailments, Ninja Tabi to further increase your move to get closer to enemies, and to run away when you are low on HP or need that MP. And lastly, Galmia Frock as it provides some of the best stat boosts for armor in the game. To sum it up, this build for Adele has great mobility that lets you do insane damage while being immune to all negative status ailments with a ribbon. That is all I have for you today. Leave that like, comment, and subscribe to show your appreciation. It honestly helps me out a ton. Thanks again for watching, and see you all on the next video.